Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I've got a different type of video today. I found this error whenever I was editing a video yesterday to put up on YouTube. I was using iMovie on my iPad to edit this video and I had a huge frustration whenever I was trying to export it. It would get to about 75% and it would stall. Turns out this is a pretty common problem and I did some research and I figured out how to fix it and I think I can explain it better than some other people did on YouTube. All right guys, I'm gonna get right down into what I did to fix it. This is the movie this was happening on called Coming Home. Notice it's a 20 minute long clip and I don't know if that has anything to do with it, but it might. So here's what I did to fix it. I click on edit and you'll notice a lot of these video clips like this one right here, the speed is sped up. That's what those little dots are for. So if you go to speed, you'll notice I put it at 2x. Apparently this exact same issue happens if you slow stuff down into slow-mo. So sped up or slow-mo, apparently this is what happens. There's some sort of conflict with the audio and the video of the slowed down or sped up file. So any of these that like I have that are sped up or slowed down, all you gotta do is select the file like I just did, hit actions, then hit detach audio. And that's pretty much will do it. Now you'd have to do it to each one of these files that you have slowed down or sped up, but that's pretty much all you have to do. Now in my case, I've got an audio track playing in the background you can see, and so on these clips, I had the volume turned all the way down, right there. So in that case, I would recommend selecting the audio file like that, then pressing delete. And do that with each one of these audio files, and then you do not have to mess with it. Just do that with each one of these all the way across. Again, I've already done that. I'm just showing you the same thing, so that's why I'm not gonna select every single one. But all of these files where I had them sped up, those are the ones that are the problem. These that are not sped up, like this small file right here, there's no problem. So you don't have to detach the audio on those, only on the ones that have a speed change. And that's pretty much it. Once you're done with everything, hit done, you're back here, hit export, Save video, 1080p, and it'll go all the way. So I hope this video helps some people. I think it will. The research I did helped me, but it just wasn't explained very well. Hopefully this video will explain it much better. Feel free to share this video. Feel free to like the video, subscribe, check out my other videos, go for it. I've got a lot of cool car stuff, but at least share this video with some other people you think might be having this problem using iMovie on either their iPad or their iPhone when they're editing a video file and trying to export it. See you next time.